Many of the ancestral grasses, like these wild oats from Israel, have a trick to ensure that their seeds are planted in the perfect place. Each seed head at the top carries two long bristles called awns. And when a seed drops the ground, these awns do something truly extraordinary. They walk. The awns twist as they dry out during the day, and then when they get wet, they untwist. Tiny hairs grip onto the ground, keeping the individual moving forward. In this way, the seeds work their way along the ground until eventually they find a rock to hide under or a crack to drill into. This adaptation is useful for the plant, but not for us. It's hard to collect seeds when they drop off and walk away. So our ancestors selected plants whose seeds don't drop off, don't have legs, and don't bury themselves out of reach. They also selected those individuals which put their energy into developing much larger seeds. Close relationships like this have developed all over the world, producing the plants that are now our crops. <laughs>